Welcome to Sports Circle 345. The five-time Jamaican Olympic champion is looking for new input as she hopes to win more Olympic medals at the Paris 2024 Olympics. Jamaican sprint superstars Elaine Thompson Hera and Shelly Ann Fraser Price are moving towards the Paris 2024 Olympics under the same coach, Reynaldo Walcott. The five-time Olympic gold medal winner confirmed on Monday that she parted ways with Shanaki Osborne in early November and has now joined the Elite Performance Track Club in Kingston. Jamaica, headed by Walcott. Out of difficulties grow miracles, Thompson Hera posted on social media. The athlete's management released a statement confirming the new appointment saying, Amidst this transition, Thompson Hera remains as dedicated as ever to her craft, demonstrating an unequivocal focus on the path ahead. Her commitment to excellence is unwavering, and she is resolute in her pursuit of defending the double Olympic titles she so triumphantly earned. Besides champion Fraser Price, Walcott also coaches hurdlers Rashid Broadbell, the 2022 Commonwealth Games champion, double world bronze medalist Rochelle Clayton, and Rio 2016 Olympian Megan Tapper. The second fastest woman ever over 100 meters is looking to defend her 100 meters, 200 meters, and 4x100 titles at the Paris Olympics. Thompson Hera has struggled with injuries this season. The 31-year-old failed to qualify for the 100 meters and 200 meters at the World Championships and didn't even race the 4 x 100 m relay, where Jamaica earned silver behind Team USA, anchored by Shakari Richardson. Track and field lovers worldwide are wondering if it will work out for both Shelly Ann Fraser and Thompson Hera knowing that they are bitter rivals on the track. On the other hand, this might be what they need to push each other like old times. Shelly will see this as her last Olympics, so she will be firing on all cylinders. The question is, can Shelly Ann Fraser run 10.60s again, or can Elaine Thompson Hera regain her 10.50s form? The stage is set to see who will reign supreme.